It was a friend. I mentioned to her my interest in data analytics. And she told me about it. I read about it online from a, a Facebook post. Yeah, I signed up for it and was lucky enough to get a, a place in the bootcamp. I heard about the boot camp from a friend of mine. It was through her recommendation and me checking it out, I decided to do something while I was going to be on furlough. There's no reason not to. Why would you cut yourself short on from having more tools in your belt? There's every reason to do. So yeah, no, do it. Go for it. I have three children and I have to do the online schooling and everything. So later in the evening, I had the time to myself to attend the boot camp. So yeah, it's, it's, it's been good. It's actually been a little bit challenging. I decided to take on a part-time job and do the course. So it's been a bit of a balance to try and get it to work out and give time. Having the ability to join a course after you're done with your work, it's three days a week. For me personally, it's quite good. It's well balanced and with the work I have, I can kind of study up on the side after classes and outside of classes before the next starts. The satisfaction you get from knowing that you've done something, the in-depth thinking of where these components, these parts of software could be, and then the problem-solving side of that, the side of looking into something, breaking something, and then showing someone something that you've then found, it's like pride in a way. I think the fact that you have so many different people from so many different walks of life, it's kind of interesting to see and people want to learn and to sort of pick up on ideas and share ideas and, and, and allow each other to sort of ask questions and, and allow each other to answer them as well, which is good. So I like that a lot. You have several people around you asking questions that you wouldn't necessarily yourself have thought of. and. Also the instant assistance compared to just sitting and doing it like a module online on your own. When you're in a boot camp and having the, the teachers and the other pupils there that you can actually ask, it makes it a lot easier and a lot faster to get to grips with certain terminologies and, or just simple tasks. The software testing boot camp tasks can range from hands-on activities, formal review-based exercises, and a little bit of actual real-life testing, which to my delight really helped you sort of connect the dots. We started out by learning basic JavaScript, as in just learning the basic commands and, and figuring out how the syntaxes work together. And we've now, from that, moved on to learning Edge. But in these tasks, We've been building certain apps, something as simple as a color changing website. But when you start looking at the code underneath it, it actually becomes fairly interesting and complex. It's learning how things work together and building them up. My biggest achievement was probably making a website work. So now when I learn about APIs and modules, it's really, really nice that we actually make a website work and design something that I actually liked. We had a project to design our own app. To finally manage to get what I wanted to work was a big achievement. <laughs> because when you're looking at it, when you're building it, it seems simple. <laughs> but when you're alone on it and you're trying to do an exam on it, you realize that there's a lot you still need to learn. So <laughs> getting that to work was, uh, was a big achievement. The most challenging thing, I would say, for me, I was learning something completely new and completely different to my previous studies and experiences. I was a bit worried to not to be at the same level as the other students, but I'm really enjoying it and I feel excited every time I'm joining a new session. My mock score, I scored about half the marks I needed and I've never actually gone back and watched all the lessons through in my own time and now I'm sort of doing that, I'm up to chapter two now. It's really getting in my head now. I'm managing to get like 100% in these uh, chapter questions we got sent. So I was really struggling to understand like what a test script, procedure, schedule, all these different things were. And then finally, when I did this script, it really put it into perspective of what I actually am doing. So yeah, it really was, really was the best part for me. Sometimes they're going so fast. If we need any help with anything, they will stop and go back and teach us again and show us the code. And like Z takes a bit of time for us in case something goes wrong. And yeah, that's pretty good. Go ahead with it because the courses are very clear and the teachers are really 
patience with all the students. If anyone is looking at joining the boot camps that you run with Purple Beard, then I can only recommend it. It's been super fun and much learning uh, involved in it so far. So anyone considering, sign up. You have to practice and you have to be patient with yourself. Don't think you're just going to get everything in one go. You have to keep on practicing and having a go at it and then you get better. Have a go at it, see how you do. It starts off a little easy and then it progressively gets a little harder and that's where you really start to learn stuff. It's okay if you make mistakes. Keep on going and just keep on trying. Educative. Brilliant. 